So hi friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel Information in Educational Video. So in this video, I will talk about a very important topic related to JEE mains 2022 that is save a score for NIT. That is the minimum marks that you need to score at least to get the NIT with CS branch and other possible branches also such as material science, engineering, biotechnology or civil engineering. So for that also, I will provide you the safer score and for all type of category that is for general EWS, OBC, SC, ST, all type of category safer score I will provide you here and also I will provide you the separate safe marks for male and female as you also know there is a separate cutoff for male and female candidate in each category so i will provide you the male and female both separate cutoff in this same video so if you are first to my channel please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get the complete information in the future days also related to j mains and j advance along with the other entrance exam also in this same channel so please try to subscribe it's my humble request so let's start this video so here is a safe score for nit so before going forward for this video i would like to inform you that i have already uploaded the video related to Mark. sources percentile for JE 2022 one day ago you can check that video and there I have considered all, all type of paper that is e-paper moderate paper and top paper and according to that how will be your corresponding percentile for a particular mark so you can check that video also so that you will find this video more useful so uh, so if you haven't watched my previous video try to watch that video you will get that link in the i button as well as in the description box also you will get the link for that video uh, so yeah, again I will consider three type of paper that is if moderate paper came then how much marks you should have if, if easy paper then how much marks for to be safe for NIT for CS branch or other least possible branches and for top paper as well so that you will have the complete information and according to that you will do your preparation and this video will surely help you in your preparation by, uh, for setting a goal for your preparation so uh, please try to watch the video till the end so here so, is the information that is for general candidate if you are looking for CS in any possible NIT then you should have at least 160 and 150 marks for male and female and for other branches that is the lowest possible branch in NIT you should have 130 and 120 marks for male and female respectively and this is for moderate paper I am telling you this is for moderate paper for, for easy. easy and tough paper I will talk later in this video so here is the next one that is for EWS the marks required will be 150 and 140 for male female for CS branch and for other branches it is 120 and 110 marks so next if you talk about for OBC candidates similar type of marks will be required because as you also know OBC and EWS cutoff remains almost similar. So next if you talk about for SC candidate because there was so much demand from SC a student that please make a safer score uh, video. So I am here to provide you and I would like to inform you one more thing that it takes time. So please try to like the video, share the video and provide your comment also that is the most important thing so that I can improve my video day by day. Your comment and input will be, uh, will be very helpful for me to improve the information and quality of my video. So please try to comment down if you need any other video or if you have a suggestion you can comment down your suggestions so that I can take those from my next video. So, so for SCS student 90 and 80 marks will be required for male and female for CS branch and for other 60 and 50 marks will be required and this is the least possible that I am telling you if you score more than that you will get better uh, better NIT as well but, but the least mark that you should at least have to get a college in JOSA counseling not the CSEP counseling. As you also know in CSEP counseling anything can happen and, and I have already guided so many students in the 2021 CSEP counseling and they got very good option and very less rank also so in CSEP anything can happen but from now you can't take the CSEP for guaranteed for now you have to take the reference from JOSA counseling because in JOSA counseling maximum a student wants to get the seat so I will advise you keep the cutoff marks for JOSA counseling not the CSEP counseling of course you will you will get a better chance in the CSEP counseling if your rank will be low then uh, you will get the chance but that uh, but that you can't think right now you have to take the reference from the JOSA counseling that's why I am cons considering the JOSA counseling and according to that I am providing you the cutoff according to the current year trend after, after reviewing the last year, year cutoff also and all those things because I am doing the counseling to the student from last so many years so I have so considered all those data that's why it was taking so much time so I am here to provide the complete information so please try to watch the video till the end so for next if you talk about for ST candidate then uh, for CS 80 and 70 marks will be required for male and female and for other branches 5 and 50 marks will be required so this is all about the safer score for NIT if the paper will be 
moderate and so there might be five to seven marks variation depending on the level of the paper because uh, as you also know some paper are moderate to tough it also considered as moderate but it may be tough it may be a uh, more tougher than the moderate paper so in that case you will get the seat with less marks also but if it is easy to moderate then you have to uh, score a little bit more so before going forward for this video i would like to inform you that i will provide you the similar type of information for pwd candidate as well in a special video so if you are a pwd student or if you know any pwd student then please try to subscribe this channel and share this video to your friends so that they can also get the information through this channel because i will regularly provide the information for all the category so that's why it is a request to all of you please try to support me as well so that i will get some confidence from your side so that i want more hard for uh, for you all so please try to share and subscribe this channel that will provide some support to me so next if you talk about for easy paper so this is the this is the most uh, worst thing that uh, that happened to the student last year that is if you uh, score good mark then also you will get less percentile and you are not going to get the better college even after scoring good marks because every student will able to score better marks but you have to prepare according to that that's why i'm providing you the information right now so that you will be prepared for that if easy paper came then you may uh, score more marks according to your preparation so here is the information for general 185 and 175 marks will be required for cs in any possible nits so you can see how much is the difference and for other lowest possible branches your marks would be 160 and 150 for male and female for ews 175 and 168 for cs and for other other branches 150 and 140 so after slash the marks is for female candidate because the female candidate having the separate cutoff in the josa counseling that's why i'm, I'm providing you the separate marks for the female candidate so next if you talk about for obc similar type of cutoff will be there and for sc 120 and 110 marks will be required for cs and for other branches 85 and 75 marks so next if you talk about for st candidate 105 and 95 marks will be required for cs and for other 70 and 60 marks will be required for the easy paper so this is all about the safe score for nit that is the minimum marks that you need to have for nit in case of easy paper so one more thing i would like to inform you that regularly i will provide you this type of information and also i will provide you the percentile versus category rank that will help you to estimate more, co more accurately what you are going to get in this year of josa counseling and uh, cc counseling or any other counseling if you will do how much will be your category rank based on your percentile that you are going to get in the examination so all those things you will get in the same channel so please try to subscribe the channel and if you haven't watched my previous video that is the marks versus percentile for each type of paper that is easy tough and moderate you can check that video in the i button as well as the description box you will get the link so now I would like to introduce the Philo app where you can get the solution of all your question, doubt or you have problem with any type of concept related to J or NEET or boards examination. Then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps. That is first you have to download the Philo app in the play store and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number and after that take the photo of your question and upload that in the app. And after that within 60 seconds you will be connected to the India's best educator. In question, you want to say how power is the bulb? वो 220 वोल्टेज पर ऑपरेट हो रहा है राइट इस बैटरी का जो वोल्टेज है वो आपको गिवन है 220 तो ये आपको सिंपल रिलेशन हो गया यहां पर अब अगर कोई आपको और डाउट है तो बताइए सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग योर टाइम डाउनलोड द फिलो ऐप लिंक इज अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड यूज द कोड IEB001 यू विल गेट द 10% इंस्टेंट डिस्काउंट so next if you talk about for tough paper so this is the best case for the student even if you score very low marks your expected percentile will be more than what you what you will expect uh, during the examination so here is the information for tough paper that is for general 140 and 130 marks will be enough to get the cs in any possible nit and for other branches only 115 and 105 marks will be required for male and female candidate so next if you talk about ews the student then for cs 130 and 120 marks will be required and for other 105 and 100 marks will be required so next if you talk about for obc same uh, same type of cutoff will be there and uh, for sc 70 and 60 marks will be enough to get the cs in lowest possible nit and for other branches 50 and 45 marks will be enough and uh, for st candidate 60 and 50 marks for cs and 40 and 35 marks for other branches so this is all about the safe score for nit for all type of paper i have considered that is easy moderate and tough for all type of category and male and female that is general aws obc scst male female all type of information i have provided you in this video so if you haven't watched the video from start try to watch it again and please try to subscribe this channel and share this video to your friends so that i will get some support from your 
your site so that I can improve my video day by day. Also provide your input through the comment section. Have you find this video useful or not? Or which type of information I should provide in, in my future videos? So those things I would like to be get through the comment section. So please try to do that and please try to share and subscribe the channel. Thanks, so thanks again for watching this video.